The U.S. Air Force first deployed 5,000 pounds monster aerial bomb, GBU-28 during Operation Desert Storm in Iraq 1991. Effectively taking out hard, usually underground targets, Bunker Buster got its nickname and earned respect on the battlefield. The exact capabilities of the Air Force's current GBU-28-BS, which now uses new advanced BLU-122 warheads are classified. But the original design reportedly had the ability to penetrate through more than 150 feet of earth and at least 15 feet of reinforced concrete. As Air Force expects the upcoming GBU-72-B to have much better performance than the predecessor. Right now, the Air Force says that additional test flights as part of ongoing developmental and future operational testing of the GBU-72-B are set to continue into 2022.